focus come on camera focus there we go hey guys we have been sent well i say we delilah has been sent an exciting parcel of toys for her to try out you're doing it again my lovely <laughs> you're blocking me she is eagerly wanting to get into these toys and play with them as you can see you're trying to run away with it Shall I get it out? Shall I get it out? Okay, so we have teamed up with Tesco to do a review of their toys. These toys are by Carousel Toys and it's Tesco's own toy range, which I didn't know. I knew Tesco sold toys, but I didn't know they had their own toy range. I had a little look online um, and it all looks very affordable. They contacted me and as you know, I've done a bit of work with them recently. I enjoy collaborating with them and they asked if myself and mainly Delilah would like to try out a selection of their toys and give you my honest uh, honest opinion on them and see uh, you know see how much Delilah likes them she's currently trying to get into this one so I'm gonna let her have a little play with this this is the drum and piano set she loves her music sets um, it's from 12 plus months and she's already been banging away at it wow. also can I say that these like little black things when did these become a thing because I remember when I was younger, having to painstakingly cut lots of like plastic bits off the toys that attached it to the cardboard. These little black things, you just turn and the toy comes straight off. So much easier. Like, when did those become a thing? Yeah. Yeah, you got drums. So this comes with like a little mini piano. And then you got a little drum. I don't know who's more excited about this item, myself or Delilah. This is... Um, the other item that we've been sent. We also got sent this um, fun little cube that you also put batteries into. And I actually, and I, oh! Delilah's been playing with this for the last few days. She loves this. Um, everything else she has been kept in the box, but I took one item out to let her, um, let her play with. The item I've been really excited about is this, a play table. And I think she's going to love this. So we're gonna build it in a little bit, aren't we? <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> Are you ready to open it? Should we open it? Go. <laughs> Go. Cool. Oh, so this is the uh, this is the table. I'm assuming these are the legs. Just need to grab some scissors. All right, Bubba, you've got to let mommy put it together. <laughs> We've got all the legs in here. Oh, there's even like some little extra blocks and stuff. I'm hoping she's going to be patient enough to let me attach these. Let's do this. is just the sweetest thing it's even nicer than i thought it was gonna be we've got like these little animals that go back and forth here xylophone thing so you can pop the shapes through here you could do it almost good 
go fluffy tiger thing and these which she loves i remember playing with these in the um at the bank and in the doctor's surgery when i was younger oh gosh how cute is that little playstation hello she's just having a little snack i a skip no <laughs> yeah hello hello are <laughs> you saying hello hello tiger <laughs> It looks like we've not moved, but we've actually been to we've been to Monkey Music, and we've come home. We've had lunch. We've had a nap, um, a very short one, may I add. <laughs> but um, yeah, we're back up. I've had a little bit of a tidy up because there were toys everywhere. This is what I mean. She needs just toys like this that she can really interact with, rather than all these little bits that she just flings everywhere and doesn't actually play with them. My mission this weekend is to one not only clear up all those boxes that you see in the background oh i try and like not include them in the vlogs but i've just realized i did a little montage and you can just see those boxes in the background but also i'm going to clear out all of those toys in the basket that she doesn't use anymore because she's too old for them and donate them but yeah we're having a good old time playing in our little band aren't we <laughs> is that good song you gonna come play with these? Can you do that one in the triangle one? Put the zebra in the square. Good job! High five! Yeah. High five! She's like, Mum, you just leave me to play with this, please. Good job! Just noticed that the faces match up with the print on the on here so that the hippo matches up with the little the little ears here we are going to try out these toys for the next few days and i will catch up with you guys in a couple of days come here every vlog days since we unboxed the Lila's new toys. <laughs> hi darling! Hello! <laughs> say hi! Even though technically we said hi a second ago in the vlog. But it's been a few days, don't grab the camera. She's got my other vlogging camera in an attempt to stop her grabbing this one. Delilah's impression of the toys, she loves them. Um, they keep her really engaged. She loves the musical ones, so she loves them. I'll get it. She loves uh, this little one. She also loves the block that's in the background. So it has all the all the animal sounds and it plays music. She loves flicking these. With this one, she loves putting these shapes through the holes. Um, it's really great. It really um really encourages her um what's it motor skills motor skills. It helps her kind of like coordination, putting shapes in the right shape, and she's gotten really good at it. She also loves the beads that go around here which i think is a firm favorite with most ki most kids i remember loving this sort of stuff look i'm playing with it now from a parent perspective my favorite has to be the table because it's so sweet i love wooden toys in particular but it is still nice and bright and colorful 
and um, engages her visually and her imagination and stuff. It feels like a good quality um, toy. I don't mind having this in the living room because it looks it looks lovely. <laughs> yeah. The only thing I have to fault it on is the assembly. It was a little bit difficult getting all the screws in the legs. I know I'm quite good with stuff like that. You know, I made sure I lined them up and um, screwed them in like a little bit by a little bit. But they just like some of them just quite weren't quite. Aligning just took me a little bit longer than um, it normally would to build something like that So maybe I recommend building it before you give it to your little one to play with apart from that I can't fault the stuff. They're lovely toys uh, Reasonably priced and I actually feel like she's got something that she plays with now And I think they're worthwhile toys getting whereas some of the toys in the background I feel like we've wasted money on in the past um, and especially like some stuff, some toys are really expensive. Tesco haven't told me to say this, but I was just thinking about this um, the other day. I've been in toy shops before and I've been actually shocked at how expensive some of the toys are for what they are. So I feel like you do get good value for money with these. We've still got these boxes because we're yet to put them in the recycling. But I love that on these boxes has these little things in the corner. So it would tell you which age group they're suitable for. As you would have seen before she took it away. There's also, um, I'll show you on this one. So as well as uh, having the age group, it tells you kind of what each toy is kind of good for. So here with the with the play table, it says um, it helps with sensory development, hand-eye coordination, which which I was um, talking about with like the the beads and the, the blocks and fine motor skills. Yeah, it was motor skills. I'm not talking to nobody in the corner dog sat behind the camera. So yeah, I like that it tells you kind of what it helps development wise. Um, because toys are great and it's great for them to play, but it's also good for them to I don't know help them learn. You can just be like, oh great, yeah, it's cool. It does all does all of those things. I don't know, I that's a nice little touch. It just makes shopping a lot easier. Yeah. Apart from that, I don't really have anything else to say. I think these these toys have been a success. There will be a link in the description to the um, Tesco carousel toys toy page. So if you want to go and have a look at them, I know Christmas is coming up. Like I would have been more than happy to have received any of these for Christmas for Delilah. Hopefully that didn't sound like I was just given a good review for the sake of giving a good review like this. It's just my genuine opinion. Um, the only thought I had was just it was a little bit difficult to build. That was it. This wasn't a, a usual vlog of mine. This was just like a little bonus video between um, my usual vlog. So if this wasn't your cup of tea, don't worry. I'll be back tomorrow proceeding with a normal vlog. I hope those of you who have watched this video um, have found this a little bit helpful. And um, I will see you in my next vlog. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Oh, kisses. Oh, kisses.